Hello everyone, uh, this is Ma'am Mariani again. Today we will be learning about general knowledge and the topic is about national samples of our country. The topic is about national samples of our country. It is a very interesting topic, again very very important. So you all have to listen to me very carefully and also you have to follow me accordingly. So can we do that? Okay, so let's get started. So here is the question. I have a question for you all before starting with the topic. All right, so the question is, what is the name of our country? What is the name of our country? I can hear somebody saying, India. And that is absolutely correct. So the spelling is I-N-D-I-A, India. Very good. Can we repeat it again? I-N-D-I-A, India. Very good. So today, we will be learning about the national symbols of our motherland. So when we say motherland, that is our country. And when we say our country, the name of our country is India. Let's get started. All right. So, national symbols defines our country, our traditions and culture. Because of the national symbols, people from outside India, they get to know about us. All right. Okay. So national symbols defines about our country, our traditions and our culture. So the first national symbol that we're going to learn about is, we will be learning about all this. Okay. We will be learning about all this. However, we will be learning it one by one. All right. Okay. So what is this? What is this? This is the national flag of India. Very important. This is the national flag of India. So let's try to know about the national flag of India deeper. Okay. So the national flag of India is called the Ranga. Please remember the national flag of India is called the Ranga. Spelling. T-I-R-A-N-G-A, Diranga. Can we do it one more time? T-I-R-A-N-G-A, Diranga. Our national flag is also known as tricolor. Our national flag is also known as tricolor. Spelling T-R-I-C-O-L-O-R. Again, T R I C O L O R, dry color. Now you all have a powerful observe. You all have a observation power, right? So now you know that our national flag we have three color, right? So before that, can you see a wheel in the middle? Can you see a wheel in the middle? This wheel is called a Shoka Chakra. This wheel is called Ashoka Chakra, spelling A-S-H-O-K-A-C-H-A-K-R-A, Ashoka Chakra. So this is the round that you see in the middle and it looks like a wheel. Okay, so this is Ashoka Chakra, which is seen in the middle. Okay. So our national flag has three colors. Our national flag has three colors. So at the top, at the top is saffron spelling. S-A-F-F-R-O-N, saffron. At the top is saffron spelling. S-A-F-F-R-O-N, saffron. Okay. You can see in the middle, it is white spelling. W H I T E, white, again, W-H-I-T-E, white, very good. Now, at the bottom, okay, at the bottom, it's green, 
spelling G R E E N green again G R E E N green so it is very important so I'll be repeating again national flag of India is called Diranga it is also called tricolor it has three colors at the top is saffron in the middle is white and at the bottom is green okay all right so this is about the national flag of India so now this is the national animal of India everybody can identify this picture yes or no so this is a tiger this is a tiger spelling D I G E R tiger again D I G E R tiger so do not forget the national animal of India is tiger however I have to make it very clear to you all this is the national land animal which means they live on the land they do not live in the water they live on the land that's why this is called the national land animal of India okay all right so this is the national flower of India beautiful flower and this flower is called lotus this flower is called lotus can you spell after me l o t u s lotus again l o t u s lotus so the national flower of india is lotus all right okay so this is a national water animal of india this is the national water animal of india and the name is dolphin it is dolphin spelling d o l p h i n dolphin again d o l p h i n dolphin so now let me check your memory power national land animal is tiger right national water animal is dolphin do not forget that all right okay wow such a beautiful bird can you see the colorful feathers okay this is a very beautiful bird in fact incredible bird magnificent bird and this is the national bird of india so the national bird of india is peacock the national bird of india is peacock spelling p e a c o c k peacock again p e a c o c k peacock very good so the national bird of india is called peacock right okay so wow this is a juicy fruit and i'm sure you all know this fruit right can you help me in remembering the name of this fruit this is a mango this is a mango spelling m a n g o mango again m a n g o mango so mango is the national fruit of india mango is the national fruit of india all right okay so very juicy and this is our national fruit okay all right our national emblem of india i want all of you to look into the picture very thoroughly i want all of you to look into the picture very very thoroughly all right so the national emblem of india is this okay so you will see a four-headed lion you will see a four-headed lion facing in the different directions you will see a four-headed lions facing into different directions one in the front one here here and the other one there okay so you'll see four-headed lion facing in different direction and this is the national emblem of india 
Okay. All right. And this is the pride and the honor of our nation. Okay. All right. Now, this is a big tree. Yes or no? This is a huge tree. So, this is the national tree of India. And the name is Banyan tree. The name is Banyan tree. Can we spell it together? B A N Y A N. Banyan. Again, P A N Y A N. So, this is the national tree of India. And this is Banyan tree. All right. Okay. So, can you see a picture here? Okay. So, this is the national currency of India. How many of you knows a 10 rupees note? How many of you knows a 500 rupees note? How many of you knows 100 rupees note? Every one of you know, you know, and you can identify a paper note, right? So, the national currency of India is called rupee. The national currency of India is called rupee. Spelling R U P double E. Rupee. Again, R U P double E. Rupee. So, see, when you are going to buy sweets, your parents are giving you 10 rupees. So, we say 10 rupees. Yes or no? And why do we say that? Because the national currency of India is rupee. So, we say 100 rupees, we said 500 rupees, we said 200 rupees, we said 10 rupees, you know. So, the national currency of India is rupee. Okay, the national currency of India is rupee. Okay, wow, this is a vegetable and this is a, this is a pumpkin. Okay, so the national vegetable of India is pumpkin. Okay, again, the national vegetable of India is pumpkin. Spelling P-U-M-P-K-I-N. Pumpkin. Again, P-U-M-P-K-I-N. Pumpkin. So, this is the national vegetable of India. All right. Okay, so now this is very important. I request all of you to pay attention when I'm explaining this. All right. So the national anthem, the national anthem of India is Jana Gana Mana. Okay, the national anthem of India is Jana Gana Mana. And we sing this in the school. Jana gana mana adina yake jaya he. Okay, and it goes. So, the national anthem of India, because everybody knows it, that is jana gana mana. And when we are singing our national anthem, we have to stand straight and we have to pay respect to our national anthem. So, when you are singing in the school your national anthem, I request you all to stand straight and to sing with all of your heart. All right, everybody? Okay, so the national anthem of India is Jana Gana Mana. And how do we sing? Jana Gana Mana Adinaya Ki Jaya He Bharat Bhagya Vithadha. Right? It's very long, so I will not be able to sing all. However, you can practice at home. Okay? All right. So now, the national song of India. Please do not forget, national anthem is different from national song. Okay, so the national song of India is Vande Madaram. Vande Madaram. Spelling V-A-N-D-E-M-A-D-A-R-A-M. Vande Madaram. Again, v a n d e M A T A R A M Vande Madaram. So the national song of India is Vande Madaram, and this is how we sing Vande Madaram. Okay, so this is the national song of India Vande Madaram. All right, so now very quickly, let me check your memory power. The national anthem of India is. Okay, I can see someone saying Jana Gana Mana. Very good. Well done. 
Okay, okay. National song of India is Vande Madaram. Okay, so please do not forget this very important symbols of our country. All right, okay. So I have a little extra information because we're done with the national symbols of our country. Okay, so I have a small information and that information is about this very important man. Can you see this picture? Can you identify this man? He is none other than Mahatma Gandhi. He is Mahatma Gandhi. And he is the father of our nation. So who is the father of our nation? Mahatma Gandhi. Spelling M-A-H-A-T-M-A-G-A-N-D-H-I. Mahatma Gandhi. So if, if somebody is asking you, who is the father of our nation, then you can tell them Mahatma Gandhi. When your teachers are asking you, who is the father of our nation? Smartly tell them Mahatma Gandhi. All right? Very good. Okay, so now I have a small classwork for all of you. The classwork is, our national flag has dash colors. Is it three? Is it four? Is it two? So at the count of five, you have to give me the correct answer. One, two, three, four, five. So our national flag has three colors. Bravo, excellent for getting it right. Well done. All right. Okay, so I have a small homework for all of you. But before that, before that, can we try to recall the national symbols of our country? Maybe not all, but just few. Okay, all right. So the national flag of India is dry color or you can say diranga. The national anthem of India is jana gana mana. National song of India is vande Madaram. National animal of India is tiger, right? National flower of India is lotus. Very, very good. Well done, everyone. So this is our small homework for you all. So this is a kind request to the parents who are watching this video along with your ward to kindly help your ward in typing the answer in the chat box. So the question is, which of the following is the national fruit of India? I repeat again, which of the following is the national fruit of India? Is it watermelon? Is it strawberry? Is it grapes? Is it mango? So you have to type the answer in the chat box. Please make sure to mention your name and also your school so that, so that, okay, whenever I'm checking your homework, I will be able to know your lovely name, okay? So that's it for today. I will see you all again in my next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye, everyone.